Hello all, in this video I am going to recommend 4 important books or 4 finest books that you will have to read in order to master C programming language. If you ever wish to become an expert C programmer then you have to read these 4 books that I am going to recommend in this particular video. And you don't need to refer to any other uh, books or uh, materials other than the ones that I am mentioning here because anything and everything that you need to become an expert C programmer is already covered in these books that I am recommending here. Having said that, let me quickly get into the recommendations. The very first recommendation that I have for you is the C programming language written by the implementer of C language himself and he is none other than Dennis M. Ritchie. So the beauty of this book is that Ritchie has explained the C syntax and concepts in such a crisp and straightforward manner and also in detail. I don't think there is any other book in the book market that can explain you the C syntax and concepts in such a beautiful way like how Ritchie has done in this book. The other highlight of this book is that this book contains 8 chapters and each chapter contains lots of solved as well as unsolved programming exercises. By the time you complete reading this book, your problem solving skills and your programming skills would have gone to the next level. Therefore, if you want to master C syntax concepts and if you wish to become an expert programmer, the only book that I would actually recommend to you is the C programming language written by Kernighan and Ritchie. Right? So having said that, this is my first book recommendation for anyone who wants to uh, start learning C language. Now, coming to the second book recommendation. 90% of C language is pointers. So if you want to master C language, you have to master pointers. And if you want to master pointers, you have to read this book called as Pointers on C written by Kenneth A. Reek. Each and every chapter in this book has exercises which has given lot of importance on pointers. And if you wish to master pointers, this is the only book that you will have to read. I have found many students telling me that sir I know C language but I don't know pointers. So it's as simple as that. If you don't know pointers it means you don't know C language. And if you and many people find pointers very difficult to understand. They find pointers very difficult to understand is because they have not found really good resources or materials that have explained pointers in a very simple and step by step manner. And if you want such a book which will explain pointers in a step by step manner then you will have to refer to this book called Pointers on C which is written by Kenneth A. Reek. So this is my second book recommendation if you want to master C programming language, right? Now the third book recommendation is C traps and pitfalls. I have seen lot of programmers saying me this that you know they are very good at programming but very weak in you know debugging. So if you are one among them, if you feel you are very weak in debugging then you have to read this book called as C traps and pitfalls written by Andrew Koenig. It's a wonderful book which will cover lot of real time examples where people can actually make mistakes, silly mistakes in C programming and all such kind of uh, mistakes and how to debug those kind of mistakes are very neatly explained and covered in this book and uh, the best book that will help you in uh, you know, improving your C debugging skills is C traps and pitfalls written by Andrew Koenig. It's a must read if you really want to improve your debugging skills. Now coming to the fourth book suggestion, it's for advanced C programmers who wants to know how uh, best C programs can be written in real time. It means how can you implement C programming in real time projects, okay, then you got to refer this book called as Expert C Programming Deep Sea Secrets written by Peter V. D. Linden, okay. So Peter van der Linden, right. So the best part of this book is that it is suited for advanced C programmers, okay. It will reveal the best coding techniques used by the world's best C programmers. Lot of real time examples have been given in this book, right. And it will teach you the practical implementation of C language in the real world projects. Right? So if you have already mastered C programming language and if, and if you wish to know how to implement that in the real world or if you want to know the best coding practices followed by the world's best C programmers then you got to refer to this book. So these are the four best books on C programming that you got to refer. Okay, So let me give you a quick roadmap. Right? 
now so if you are a beginner if you are uh, if you want to learn c programming syntax and concepts and if you want to improve your logical programming skills then you will have to refer to this book called as the c programming language written by karnigar and ritchie okay and uh, because 90% of c language is pointers you got to be really good at pointers and if you want to master pointers you will have to refer to this book called as pointers on c written by kenneth erick right and if you want to improve your debugging skills right real debugging skills then you will have to refer to this book called c traps and pitfalls written by andre konik and if you want to know how uh, programs are written in real time okay and if you are an advanced c programmer then you will have to definitely refer to this book called as expert c programming so these are the four best and finest books that you can find uh, in the world or in the sea in the ocean of c language these are the four books that you will have to actually refer to become an expert c programmer right so these are my recommendations and if you feel that i have missed any uh, good books on c language you can please uh, uh, post it in the comment section below if you have liked this video please don't forget to subscribe and click on the bell icon okay so meet you in the next video until then take care bye see you